Energy and of course that these are the three main demands for which the future meta is launching two days shipping So today is the second day, the last day. We are seeing and observing a great response of the people of the state. We believe, we are insisting the central government to move the issue on the floor of the parliament in the next ensuing parliament, parliament system. And we are asking the state government also to initiate the assembly also, because it has to be viewed from the state government. So they cannot deny the demand and the support of the people of the state. Therefore, today also, we believe that the state government and the central government will record the support of the people of the state. That will indeed insist on the government to consider and implement according to the democratic system and constitutional. So these are the three points we have to make. Thank you. Another thing, sir, uh, one, if you are insisting the central government and the state government, TTADC headquarters, it could be held at anywhere in Agartala, because so that the government can hear it. We don't, we don't mind for that. We have applied to have pull it out. They are not allowing any demonstration in the municipality area. So we are still having some case which we launched almost almost four years back now. We have two cases in the court. We have launched in front of the stable ground. It was only three or four hundred people, very peaceful. We have applied to the High Court. High Court has logistically granted about a zero. Supreme Court has a ruling for any individual, for any group of people in the nation, in the country, they have right to explore and to emphasize their demand, their needs constitutionally. Therefore, the central government has given specific direction to the central government and the state government, even the Jantar Mantar also, because people used to go there to explore, to expose their demand. So we also wanted to expose our demand before the state government, the central government, but they are not allowing. So we feel very bad. And if we have any chances in the future, we will allow the public to explore, to expose their cry before the government, before the people, before the state and the nation. So we are surprised why the state government is so allergic, why they are denying, why they are afraid of people's coming up with some voice. They must have some witness, so we don't know. You can ask them why they are not allowed. But they are holding their meeting. Ruling are holding their meeting, but they are not allowing the opposition parties. What is the reason? They should ask and reserve why they are not allowing. Are they really believing the constitution and democracy? This is a big question. Anyway, we are not waiting for the time for the permission, for the time of it. But we have decided that there will be stronger movements in the to come. We will be launching more and more stronger and stronger movements for which state government may not be able to control. Therefore, today you have seen the response of the people and we are really grateful for the media people here covering all kind of incidents, all kind of development and issues also. So that I will also give thanks to the media for all your volunteering for the people in exploring the real situation, the ground situation before the people. Can I say thank you so much?